Hey YouTube, what's up ladies and gents out there, um, my naturalistas, um, I'm coming to make a video, if you guys notice my hair is very different today, um, it's actually a lot curlier, you can actually make out my hair pattern, which is good, so you guys can help me out with that, um, but I just want to let you know that I thought my hair was cool today, I think the style would be really good if if it's somebody whose hair is like a little bit longer than mine or either probably, you know, like shoulder length. I think it'll look good like that. But it's pretty much really curly. It's so soft. I wish you guys could feel it. Um, I don't know if it looks hard, but it's really, really soft. And I want to show you guys um, the products that I use to achieve this curly thing, which isn't that impressive. But I just thought it was cool. So I'm about to show you. So today in my shower, I co-washed with the lovely Hello Hydration. Left it in my hair for 10 minutes, then and brushed it through section by section and wide tooth combed. And then I rinsed it out as usual. That's how I do. I don't know how you do. Um, and then after that, I got out the shower. My hair was still drenching wet. And I used my whipped shea butter. This shea butter has so much stuff in it. Like, oh my God, whipped shea butter is like the best thing since sliced bread. Um, I have jojoba oil, coconut oil, peppermint oil. Uh, vegetable glycerin oil uh, I don't know so much other stuff y'all I just so much stuff in here and it's just all packed in here the organic honey just made it smell sweeter I guess honey smells weird by itself but when I put it in there it smells better and then the peppermint oil probably helped too um, after that this is a gel that I showed you guys in my big shot video I've literally had it since then um, since my hair's gotten longer, I didn't find or feel I had the need to actually use any type of gel other than the Eco Styler gel around my edges. Just due to the fact that it's getting longer and the curl pattern's coming out and pretty much all I have to do is put water on it. And sometimes I put um, the grease on it, not really, but I usually use olive oil and put it on there and it just curls up. So gel's not really a necessity or it's something that I need anymore, but I just decided to try it out today. So I tried it out. It's protein and rich, um, African essence. Y'all yeah, can probably find it at any local um, beauty supply store. I haven't seen it in a Walmart, Target, or CVS or anything like that. Um, but like I said, you can probably get it at beauty supply store. And I'm rambling again. So, um, I actually kind of not really shingled it, y'all. I didn't really shingle it through. I just kind of put it on my edges. And I was like, oh, wow. You know, like, it's waving up. So, I started kind of, I shingled it a little bit all the way through. And, um... I was like, wow, you know, let me make a video. I think this looks cool. And if some of my natural sisters out there have a little bit longer hair, I think it'll probably look a lot better on you guys. Um, but again, like, my goal is not long hair. My goal is healthy hair. Um, so I believe it's um, becoming more and more healthy every day. My edges are, like, getting a lot better um, from pretty much being burned out by the relaxers. So um, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to give you guys an update and show you guys what I did. So... Uh, thank you so much to all my subscribers. I feel like I get two subscribers every day, so that's fine with me. At the end of the month, that's like 60 more people. So, um, thank you for wanting to hear what I have to say. Thank you for y'all's input. Thank you for your comments, questions, and concerns. And, um, I'm open to any suggestions. Even if you have criticism, I'm open to that. As long as it's constructive, don't just be mean. It's unnecessary. Um, I got like one mean comment after the whole year I've been on YouTube, so... That's fine. Um, some people are just ignorant. If you don't like natural hair, don't watch any of our channels. And that's just how I feel about it. I'm not trying to be rude, but I'm just being real. Which, it just irritates me when people have negative stuff to say. And they obviously haven't done their research. And they obviously don't know what we're talking about. Um, if you want to know, ask us. A lot of people on YouTube... I'm mad, I'm sorry. A lot of people on YouTube will answer your questions. They will let you know. And if you do want to educate yourself, go to the library. Get online. Google it. Find out what you need to know. Don't be ignorant. Don't make stupid or... I'm just going to say ignorant responses. It's unnecessary and it's not nice. Um, people have feelings and that's all I'm going to say about it. So, I'm not trying to be rude or mean, but just keep the negative stuff to yourself. If it's not constructive, nobody wants to hear it. If you cannot improve upon the silence, keep your mouth shut. So, that's just how I feel. Um, but yeah, so, the products that I used were the Hello Hydration, the Whip Shea Butter, and the African Essence. So, I love all my subscribers. If you're not subscribed, um, that's fine. Just let me know how y'all feel about it. So, thank you for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.